Let's go through all the bundles in the store because obviously now the store is available and I usually don't buy bundles. I don't think I've ever bought a bundle except for maybe a Call of Duty League bundle in any of the recent recent CODs. So I'm going to go through them and see what cosmetics we have here and share it all with you. Make sure to like and subscribe for more MW2 coverage. going to be a ton of coverage and gameplay videos coming out soon, but let's hop into this. So let's start out with the featured section. We have the Executive Warfighter bundle. So that comes with this uh, Warfighter skin looks pretty cool actually um you know all blacked out i can see this being a menace in Warzone. um maybe the new rose skin i mean there is going to be a rose skin in the game then you have this short fuse blueprint and you also have this uh blueprint for the spx 80 you have a weapon sticker another weapon sticker loading screen and an emblem which that emblem is actually kind of cool then we have the violet embrace and i'm obviously going to fly through these i don't want to you know waste all your time so we're just going to fly through these you have the axle skin here which looks pretty cool uh razor wire uh, barbed wire thing that's a pretty cool weapon charm not gonna lie this emblem is also pretty sick I and mean, it's really flickering though that's a that's a lot right there and then you have the atomic sunrise uh you know pretty decent skin there uh, this looks kind of, you know, wasteland. I mean, I, that's literally what it says right there. Wasteland, sort of apocalyptic type style. Uh, that's disgusting. But overall, pretty cool. This is another emblem that's really freaking moving. Um, and then we have this a bundle here. This is called Tactical Human. Uh, pretty cool. That's a pretty cool looking thing. Um, overall, pretty cool. That loading screen is off. That is a terrible loading screen. I understand it's supposed to be, it's literally called lens flare. So, but I mean, that's pretty bad. I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, definitely not interested in that. Then we have operators. So I guess this is another way to kind of unlock operators. So this is a, this is the ghillie skin, which is pretty cool. Uh, that it looks pretty cool as well. That looks really cool. Um, that's not too bad. These are pretty sick. I do like uh, the sticker emblem and uh, weapon. Those are two stickers, actually. Then we have the greased and camoed. Uh, you know, nothing, nothing too crazy there. Nothing too crazy. Recruited, another pretty basic bundle. I guess if you don't have any of these operators unlocked, it could be something you could look into. Now we have some blueprints. So this is the fabled dragon and the steel fire blueprints. Um, overall, nothing too, too crazy. We have the, what is this called? The Lock Hat, Lock Katrina. Uh, that looks really sick. That looks like a skin out of like Counter-Strike. That looks actually really baller. These both are pretty cool. Um, we have a charm, a sticker, and an emblem. Overall, that's actually pretty sick. And then we have the Raw Tiger, which is literally just like a white tiger zebra looking thing. I mean, I know it's not a zebra, it's a tiger, but it kind of has that zebra style to it. And then we have the Call of Duty League, uh, competitive Call of Duty League bundle. So you have the male away home, female away home. Um, they look okay. They're, you know, they're nothing too special. They're just a basic Call of Duty League stuff. If you're going to buy this, I would just wait until your favorite Call of Duty League team skins come out in the store, but nothing too crazy there. Weapon camo, charm, uh, sticker, sticker, uh, calling card, calling card, emblem, and emblem. So overall, pretty cool. I mean, I don't know, maybe if you want to rock this free agent thing, that could be kind of cool, but overall, you know, nothing too crazy. As a big Call of Duty League fan myself, I'm not going to be purchasing this. I'm going to be probably waiting till the actual teams come out and then purchasing like the LA Thieves one because that is the team I mainly support. But yeah, it looks like we got some pretty cool things in the shop here. I'm going to be saving my COD points for something even better. Um, and hopefully, you know, buying one of my first bundles I pretty much ever bought in Call of Duty. So hopefully they add some more cool things. I'm looking forward to the, the football or the soccer skins that are coming out. Um, but those are supposed to be like 2400 each, which is pretty pricey. Um, I mean, these are this is 2400 right here. So this is probably similar to something we will expect out of those definitely gonna be pretty pricey. But but looking forward to seeing what those look like. Make sure to drop a like and sub for more MW2 coverage, and hopefully I'll see you all in the next video.